Well, FEMA is setting up a disaster recovery center in Temple for tornado victims needing assistance. It's located at Tarver Elementary School and it's open from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. Seven days a week. Six News reporter Cindy Deshawn takes us to the center and explains what you can expect and what you need to bring. William Hornsby lives in Rosebud with his special friend. Lucky and I, you know, he's my service dog, so we came here to fill out our application. His home saw excessive damage after severe weather hit central Texas. The area of the city where I live in was underwater, um, 18, 20 inches of water at times. This was the reality. I lost everything. For thousands. That's why FEMA is stepping in with their disaster recovery center at Tarver Elementary School in Temple. We're advocating for your disaster recovery. It's for homeowners and renters, both insured and uninsured. We've just crested $102 million in grants that are approved. Grant money can be used for basic home and car repairs, medical expenses, and more. If you need new clothing because your clothing were messed up, if you need personal hygiene, if baby needs items. FEMA has a serious needs assistance program for people with no money or resources. It's about 750 bucks. It's not a lot, but we will expedite that process. Put some money in your pocket to help you. You can fill out an application in person. You'll need to bring your ID and social security. For approval, FEMA says you'll need to verify that it's your home or your property that's been damaged. You will also need to verify that you live there. Lastly, you need to be able to share images or itemize details about your loss. FEMA hopes you'll take advantage of this opportunity. This is a service to the citizens of the United States provided by our government through our taxes. It's, it's there for us to, to use in these kinds of emergency. For 6 News, I'm Sydney Deshawn. Well, FEMA says you must get your application in by July 16th. Once approved, people could receive funding within a matter of days. FEMA is also warning people about scammers. Remember, FEMA will never ask for money.